Texas A&M's ring day is right around the corner. Hannah King has a closer look at the preparation going on in Aggieland. The Association of Former Students holds three ring days each year. The one in April is traditionally their largest, and the association says this year is no exception. Katherine Greenway with the Association of Former Students says they are expecting around 6,400 students to pick up rings this upcoming ring day. We've actually expanded ring day to three and a half days this April so that we can do an in-person delivery. Managing the number of people coming into the building at any given time, each student can bring in two guests to celebrate this moment, a moment well earned. You know, I, I think it's um, it's a shared experience. Um, you know, it's something you share with your family. It's um, something you share with the people who've been on this journey with you as students. So it was important to us to be able to resume Ring Day as quickly as we could. Celebrating this milestone the way it should be celebrated is a moment in time Tanner Miller has been waiting for. I'm an only child and both my parents are Aggies and so they both have rings and so you know, a few years ago when I got accepted into A&M, I was really looking forward to coming here and getting the full college experience and uh, getting to wear that ring my whole life is just been a lifelong dream since I was little. In a few short weeks, Miller will complete his Aggie family of three who will soon all sport an Aggie ring and says there's only one time where he could even think about taking it off. All three of us will be able to uh, wear it every day. Um, the only time I'll ever take it off is whenever I'm uh, back home on the ranch so I don't, you know, lose a finger. But uh, but yes, it'll, it'll be super special just to get to uh, wear that every day and just remember even after I've graduated how special of a time it was getting to go to college here. Greenway says there is a light at the end of the tunnel and they don't want to do anything to dim it and says even in the time of a pandemic Aggie traditions continue. And you know if we don't take the time to to celebrate and acknowledge accomplishments like that like this then life becomes mundane and so it's important that we take time and, and we we celebrate and we recognized um, important milestones like this. Last year, the April Ring Day was most impacted by the pandemic. They were not able to hold an in-person ring delivery and ended up mailing out around 6,500 rings to students. In September, in-person deliveries did resume, and in November, two guests were allowed to join and celebrate. Reporting from Texas A&M, Hannah King, 25 News.